Baruch Hashem, it is day number 239 of our daily study of Rambam Sefer Mitzvahs. And in the three chapters of Dev Mishnah Torah, we are continuing Hilchas Mikvah the laws of Mikvah. Uh, we started yesterday chapter one of those laws. Today we're on chapters two, three, and four. And we have a repeat today of the mitzvah that we learned yesterday. Here we go again. Positive Commandment 109. And it is the mitzvah of immersing in a mikvah. And the Rambam explains here that the mitzvah, a mitzvah is a commandment, which is pretty synonymous with an obligation. You are commanded to do something. You're therefore obligated. However, the Rambam explains the nature of this obligation and says it is not that a person is required to purify. It's that a person who wants the benefits of ritual purity is required to do so through immersion in a mikvah. You understand the difference? If somebody chooses to live their whole life in a state of ritual impurity, then as long as they don't do any of the things that you're not allowed to do while in a state of ritual impurity, that's your prerogative. However, if one does want to achieve ritual purity, the way to do so is through immersion in a mikvah. Okay, uh, we're going to actually be learning this mitzvah for a couple more days, so I'll share more about it with you um, as we repeat that mitzvah. I'll see you, God willing, for more tomorrow.